Hey, what's up everybody? It's Thursday. It's your Thursday email update. Is that fan bothering you? It's going to slow down here in a minute. It'll take about a minute or two. Uh, there goes 12 seconds of your time. Sorry about that. Uh, hope you guys are doing great. Thanks for coming out last night. Had a great uh, turnout from you guys as well as uh, a lot of our students. I've got a, a air breathe right thing in my nose because it's trying to, I'm trying to like get some oxygen. Um, I think I need some, um, but uh, uh, it was good that you guys came out last night. We had some new new people back, uh, or for the first time, and we had some old faces back, and that was really, really cool. I love seeing that, um, and I think we're seeing some dry bones live. I, I uh, read a blog this week of a guy that said, um, you know, a lot of times we don't see the fruit of our, uh, of, of our work, but sometimes we just get a little fruit snack, and I'm believing that in our ministry. We're seeing fruit snacks. They may not be a full size fruit, but even if it's just a fruit snack, praise God for that. Let's just uh, rejoice in those things and pray that God will continue to do things so that we'll see uh, fully reproduced fruit happening within these students and within their lives and within uh, you know their own hearts. With kids that are standing up for Christ, kids that are coming forward, kids that are giving up their whatever that one thing is, um, let's continue to encourage that, continue to inspire that. Um, so that dead bones will no longer just stay dead and dry and rattly, uh, but dead bones will have life. Um, I'm trying to evoke that vision onto our kids, and I'm praying that that will happen, um, starting with me, and then passed on to you guys, and then on to our students. So uh, make sure that you guys are right where you need to be. Make sure that there's nothing in your life that you haven't given over to God, that you have given it all up and said, God, I give it to you. Uh, be my everything. I'm working on the 525 event. We just got a Facebook page up today at our network meeting. Um, we're liking that, and we're going to start doing some, um, you know, some uh, hyperblasts on that here in the next few uh, weeks. Um, there is a meeting tonight for that, that with other youth pastors um, and some folks that we're just trying to pass this vision on to. Um, you guys are invited to be a part of this. It's not specifically for um, you guys. It's more to get the word out to people that know, have no idea what 525 is about. But um, it is something that uh, if you want to be a part of it, you let me know. Just text me because we're doing it um, at the Baptist Church tonight um, at 630. Maybe by the time you read this, you won't have gotten, gotten it. But that's okay. It's, as I say, it's more informational for people that don't know. Um, there is the spaghetti dinner tickets. Please work on that with me. Help me to, to promote spaghetti dinner. Help Jennifer to, to get people to, to bake pies. Help us to sell tickets to some high rollers that would you know pay $100 or $200 for a pie so that we can make our goal. Our goal is $5,000 for um, the church camp fund so that we can get kids to camp. I really want to promote camp. I'd love for you guys to go to camp with me. Um, take that week off, June 18th through the 22nd, because you will uh, love being a part of that. Um, as far as any other details, there is, uh, we just had our leader meeting, so we covered a lot of stuff, really, we covered schedules and dates and events and everything, so really, my main thing to you is, is just reach out to your kids, there was a lot of kids there last night that I hadn't seen in a long time, but there was also some kids that I haven't seen, um, you know, and some kids that, that are normally pretty faithful that were not here last week, you know who they are, you know who I'm thinking of, um, and they're probably on your mind right now. Make a phone call. After you hang up this uh, video email, make a phone call. Just say, hey, how are you? How you been? How's so-and-so? How's the FCATs? Um, anything I can pray with you about, anything we can do. Spend some time in discipleship. Maybe spend some time going out with them, hanging out with them. Um, do your discipleship commitments. Be a leader to your families before you're a leader to students. Um, do your family devotions. And... Um, you know, I'm, as I say, I'm keeping it kind of short, and I've been rambling a little bit, but the main thing is, is uh, thanks for all that you do. Keep the vision alive. Help us to see dead bones live. All right, guys, love you very much. If you need anything from me, reach out to me, call me, uh, but uh, I think that's it. Disciple. All right, bye.